Welcome to Taylor Maid. We Hello. will be hey. with you oh. shortly. G'day Choppers, TaylorMade HQ in Melbourne. They've offered Ron a new set of golf clubs and you know Ron loves a freebie. Let's go in and check out this place. Welcome. Ron. Ron, Mark, welcome to TaylorMade headquarters. Yeah, this is essentially our Melbourne performance lab. So it's where we do all our fittings really. So our retail partners refer punters that come through and get fit in state of the art equipment. And specs go back to the retail and yeah, they purchase their clubs fully fitted through their retailer. But nice little bar set up as well. So this is our staff simulator area. Come down here, hit some, some balls at lunch and we've got the nice little head cover collection there as well. A few limited ones there that are really hard to get. So yeah, we've got, I was just saying, we've got our custom build center here as well on our socks. So this is basically where the magic happens. All the components are housed here. Like, there's your new set. But it's irons, drivers, next year's product. No, just kidding. Is this where they're gonna make Ron's clubs? Yep, 100%. <laughs> so this is where the magic's gonna happen. This thing is the heartbeat of the custom everything we do here is only like one in the Southern Hemisphere. It's called a bullseye, but essentially it's how we bend lie loft. It's all hydraulics like to get real accurate, yeah. like ridiculously 0 0.001, as opposed to using the old lie loft machine, the old yeah. mutual. Definitely highlight of the custom build areas, our basketball ring. <laughs> <laughs> Just warming up, baby. All right, who's fitting me? Oh, Ron. <laughs> Hello. Thanks for coming down. Okay, Ron. So welcome to the TaylorMade Performance Lab. We're going to be going through Gears Sports, which really identifies exactly where the club is presented at impact. And then we're going to validate that on the GC quad and we'll obviously test it versus what you've got and brought today. Nice. Okay, so I use TaylorMade P770s, yep. but I finally go too far and I'm getting to the point where I'm just overpowering golf courses. And it's, it's not fair and I, I just need something that I know how far it's going to go. So that's why I'm here really. Perfect. And have you been fitted for the P770s? No, I did that. I uh, did that myself. Okay. Yeah. Cool, well that's what we'll go through. We'll have a look at the performance of that iron. We might even um, look at maybe what Tiger Woods, I, mean, I would liken your ability to Tiger. Um, so spot we might on. look at putting you in the t P7 TWs. Yeah, spot on. <laughs> How far do you carry it? Oh, like, it's like too long. Warm up, it doesn't count. Just in hollow one. Oh, hit it off the toe. Haven't seen that one going too far yet, Ron. Hole in one. Hole in one. Oh. This one? Gotta be closer. This one? Gotta go. Oh. What am I doing here? These are great. Thanks for your time. So you've done line angle yourself, Ron? Uh, whatever that means, yep. <laughs> okay, so we're 33, which is the standard loft, and we're 64 and a half, so a couple of degrees upright. Yep. Beautiful. And length? 0.75 over, which is, yeah, 37.75 off our standard. And then we look here just at the swing weight. which we're at D3, which is not too bad for like that length considering. And then 6.5's in the Rifle Project X. Sound about right? Yeah, whatever you said, that's great. <laughs> yeah, we'll probably show that club versus club comparison of P770 versus the P7MC, where you're gonna get that more uh, softer forging and you won't get that surprise that you're talking about. All right, beautiful. 
then like a half pitch shot or half base pitch shot, yep. and then go into like a three quarter or a full shot. Yep. So that we're kind of really trying to get what the line angle actually does for the wedges, especially a 60 degree, which might be used inside 40 meters, you know, predominantly. So yeah, basically the first two shots we'll get will be like a little five to 10 meter lob, and then we'll get those two other shots after. Does that make sense? Yep. Beautiful. Uh, just a quick question. What is the RAS number for these? Really high RAS. Excellent. We'll Optimal. Take it. Optimal RAS. What the hell is this? They're our 3D sensors. So as you can see there, Ron, the club is now in 3D. So this gives us optimal tracking of that golf club as mm. you're swinging it. Now, I do have the odd yippee doodah with a, a wedge. Okay. No, that'll cop it, that's fine. That zone there, Ron, optimal razzing. Now you can see, see the difference in the lie angle through here at impact when we're hitting a five to 10 meter shot, you know, a three quarter shot or half shot. Yep. And then we've got a full shot here. So now the lie angle is starting to change more to the toe side. Okay, so this is the big thing that we do in here is that uh, your fuller shot is obviously gonna need to be more upright, but then for that 10, 15 meter shot up to maybe like a 40 meter pitch shot, you're gonna have to really bend that lie angle a little bit flatter in your high lofted wedge. But can you see that you might struggle a fair bit if we need two degrees flat off a standard lie angle. So you're saying that my short game problems have not been because of me, because of my equipment? Absolutely. Oh, Just shit. <laughs> so Ron, we've come to the conclusion that we're into the P7MC now to control the distance a little bit more. Got you here just at standard lie angle. We did see that you were using um, two degrees upright. And now we're in the Project X 6.5 at one inch longer, which was just half an inch longer than what you got currently. Just before I go, give me the one that Tiger uses. <laughs> oh, hello. This is me, this is me. All right, you just wasted your time, Benji. This is gonna be the one for me. That's fine. Yeah, I think, that we'll, one's I think we'll stick yeah, with the P7. Cool. No, good choice. Yeah. Excellent. Cheers, no, mate. real done. Thanks very much, Benji. Melbourne yeah. Performance TaylorMade Lab. That was awesome. State of the art. And are those clubs, uh, are they ready to go now? Yep, we're uh, getting them ready for you right now. Excellent, okay. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to the channel. Thank you, TaylorMade. Wedges are fixed. I'm good. This is going to be good.